Hey guys, this is Bharadwaj with Phone Arena. And right now we have a very special unboxing for you. So what you see here is nothing other than the Microsoft Surface with Windows 8 Pro. So we already showed you the Microsoft Surface with Windows RT, but this is the other version with Windows 8 Pro, meaning full-fledged Windows 8 uh, on a tablet. So this costs around thousand dollars in the US, which translate to something around 60,000 rupees and not. Uh, this is the 64 GB version and uh, let's unbox it then. So this is actually the first time we are opening the box. This is a brand new surface. So as you can see the nicely uh, angular box slides out to reveal the perfectly rectangular box, white box this. So there you can see the surface branding again. Well, there you go. That's the uh, surface tablet right there so this is the uh, kind of heavy uh, surface with windows 8 pro so let's keep the surface aside for a while and let's see what else we got in the box we have got a stylus so the surface with windows 8 pro comes with a digitizer so it comes with a stylus too which you know uh, for inking on one note or for any other usage uh, it's very useful by the way and we have got the user manuals here stuff that we don't usually care about and then we have the huge power adapter here so this is even bigger than what we had with the uh, Surface Hard TV, guys. So it does have the same uh, magnetic pin connector as the Surface RT. So we have not bought a uh, touch cover with this, but uh, that's about it in the box. That's the main box of the Surface Pro. So let's take a look at the tablet itself. We will power it on and show you how it is. And of course, we will show you with the uh, stylus. So here's the Surface with Windows 8 Pro. Let's take a look at the hardware. Pretty nice looking device. Hey guys, so we are back. Uh, we have unwrapped the Surface Pro and uh, let's get through a quick hardware overview of the Surface Pro. So as you can see here on the right side, we have uh, connected this uh, pin connector, which is for charging. So that's a magnetic pin connector. Uh, and right besides that, you can see the uh, mini display port that's for connecting a bigger monitor to the Surface Pro, which might be really necessary sometimes. So just over at the right, here you have the uh, micro SD card slot. This supports uh, SD XC cards, so up to 64 GB or 128 GB uh, if the size permits. So right on the top here, so uh, you can see the power button right there on the top and of course you have the loudspeakers here that's a tiny loudspeaker but we hope that it's not as disappointing as the surface rt's loudspeaker so uh, otherwise it's uh, totally flush on the top on the right side uh, i'm sorry on the left side you have the 3.5 mm audio jack the volume rocker and the usb 3 port so basically the whole device on the front, you can uh, notice the 10.6 inch clear type full HD display. So this display is supposed to be amazing. We will see uh, when it turns on. 
you have the capacitor windows button here and on the top you have the 720p HD uh, recording cam. So besides that you have the ambient light sensor that's the dot right there. So the whole device on the front is completely made of glass and on the sides and the back it's made of magnesium alloy which is uh, a fingerprint magnet. As you can see here I've been handling this device just for a while and it's a complete fingerprint magnet. Anyway now it's sort of clean. Uh, this is the Windows logo on the back and at the bottom you have the connector for the uh, touch cover or the type cover if you wish to attach it. Right now we don't have it with us in the office but we will show it to you in the full review. So this is an angled uh, rear facing camera there so that's uh, a 720p camera too and right besides it you have the microphone. So that's a quick hardware overview of the uh, Surface Pro. So let's power it on. So anyway, you know, right before that, we need to show you the most important aspect of the Surface Pro, the kickstand. It opens and closes like a car, car door. That's what Microsoft says. And the whole device is made of what Microsoft calls a vapor mag finish. So this is a magnesium alloy, which uh, uh, proves that you know it's a lightweight and sturdy material and it's a lot denser than usually used aluminium so that's the kickstand right there at a certain angle uh, and inside the kickstand you have some information which you can barely see but I'll make sure you see that now uh, so anyway that's the surface with Windows 8 Pro and this is the 64 GB model so that's the thing written right there. Unlike the Surface RT, there is no micro SD card slot here because it's already there. So anyway, let's look at the operating system. Then this is the first time we are going to power it on. It's suddenly very hard to uh, use in this orientation as well because it's quite heavy. Let's put up the kickstand then possibly easier to show it to you with the kickstand as you can see there the you can see me here first of all so the surface uh, text shows that the display is really crisp I really like the pixel density here I am not sure if you can notice there but it is really nice that's the advantage of having a really good display on a tablet so we are just going to select English there. We accept everything. Next. Okay. Now this I have the uh, touch keyboard here. It's going to be a bit hard to type. But anyway I'm going to try. Very responsive the touch screen so let me just uh, connect to the our Wi-Fi then anyway so I just connected to the Wi-Fi I'm gonna use Express settings for this so I just logged into my account the Microsoft account but because uh, without that we are not going to see anything on the surface screen so uh, I want to show you the Windows 8 operating system on the Surface Pro, so that's why it's here. So anyway, let's uh, just go through what uh, the specs are again. So this has a third generation Intel Core i5 processor with Intel HD 4000 graphics, which is the onboard graphics solution, of course, but still, you know, decent enough for, uh, you know, most Ultrabooks have... Uh, this kind of a setup so that makes sense for the Surface Pro. Uh, it has 4 gigabytes of RAM and uh, it is dual channel memory so probably you have got two 2 GB sticks in there. Uh, we are also assuming that it is DDR3. So that's a quick run through of the specs so this is a 64 gigabyte version 
and uh, as you can see here it runs Windows 8 and currently it is showing how you can use the device uh, with the touch screen or rather with, with the mouse anyway I think we are done with this as you can see here the kickstand is really uh, slippery of sorts because it's easily uh, movable even on a rigid surface on a not too uh, plain surface like this table but anyway that's not really a concern the only concern though for us is that it weighs a lot like two pounds is very heavy for this device and then it's not just a tablet it does it, it begs to be used with a keyboard when you're like doing productive stuff like Microsoft Office or anything so that should be the go-to item for the Surface RT or perhaps the Surface Pro 2 so anyway let's briefly take a look at the stylus so the stylus seems to be uh, pretty normal as you can see here it's already detecting the stylus on the touch screen here if you can see the moving dot right there not sure if you can see it but yeah if I move fast you can see a dot is following the pen so this uh, stylus has a similar uh, arrangement to the oh so the mouse also move moves with the stylus so anyway so that's Windows 8 for you it's already configured with the background and the uh, my user profile everything is logged in and perfect so it seems to be synced with everything that's a good thing uh, anyway so the stylus has a magnetic connector just like the uh, magnetic connector on the power plug so this if you are not charging this will just dock in here right there that should be really useful anyway let's move around the OS and show you the desktop that's my wallpaper that was uh, used on the Windows PC and it seems like it has right translated right onto the tablet too so this is pretty awesome I mean it's just like my PC too so that's uh, really good I mean the settings everything has just transferred here really cool stuff really cool stuff so uh, let's show you something So that's the uh, control panel, which has which has even the same wallpaper as my uh, Windows PC on the desktop. The performance is absolutely stunning. It's totally unlike the Surface RT, which used to slightly lag and whatnot. Uh, this is really good. So there you go. That was. Uh, uh, a quick look at Surface RT, uh, Surface Pro uh, with Windows 8 Pro as you can see here. That's the uh, specs of the device. So that's about it. Not uh, much anything to say right now because we have a lot more to talk about in our full review which will be coming soon. So do check back and do hit the like button if you like this video do hit the like button if you like surface pro and uh, definitely subscribe to our channel for more videos like these all right thanks for watching